Hey, what's going on everyone? This is I Reviews back with another video and today I have a jailbreak update for you guys. So very good news for everyone waiting for a jailbreak on iOS 10.3.3 and below on all 64 bit devices, of course, including the iPhone 7 and the 7 Plus. We have some really great news. Seems like the jailbreak is just around the corner. So let me know in the comments right down below. Are you waiting for this jailbreak or are you waiting for the iOS 11.1.2 jailbreak, which seems to be a few days or weeks far away because we're still waiting for Soric to update Cydia and Substrate for iOS 11 or basically for the KPP less method of jailbreaking. And also, we have some good news Zimperium will release also a new exploit that will support iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2. So let's go ahead and get right into that. So the good news for everyone waiting for a jailbreak on iOS 10.3.3 and lower on 64-bit devices comes from Ben, also known as PsychoT, who is the dev of the Meridian jailbreak. So of course that jailbreak doesn't have Cydia and Substrate yet, but according to him, to his Twitter yesterday, he said that he will be adding Substitute and Cydia to his jailbreak. So basically Substitute is an alternative to Substrate and he got Cydia working. So very soon we will have a jailbreak for all 64-bit devices on iOS 10.3.3 and lower, which will have Cydia and Substitute, which means that everything will work normally. You will be able to install everything that you want from Cydia. So this is basically the same as the Electro jailbreak, but Electro doesn't have Cydia, so you will have to install manually the tweaks. With this new jailbreak for iOS 10.3.3, you will be able to install tweaks right from Cydia, just like we do normally. And luckily enough, I have kept my iPhone 7 right here on 10.3.1. Basically, I told a lot of people to stay there and I didn't update this device to iOS 11.1.2 just to keep it on iOS 10.3.1 and show you guys a bunch of tweak videos once this jailbreak comes out. As it seems, it will be released very, very soon now, just waiting here for Psycho T to just fix everything he needs and we should see this jailbreak come out very soon. And now let's talk a bit about a new exploit that will be released very soon and will support iOS 11.2 and iOS 11.2.1 and 0.2.2. And now moving on to the next topic, the new exploit that will be released and was found by Zimperium. So this exploit works with iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2 and it was of course fixed on iOS 11.2.5. So Zimperium is a very well-known security research company, so they have found this bug and another one, I believe. So yes, they have found two crucial bugs right here, you can see, and they will be releasing it very soon. So this is their blog right here. I will leave this link right down below in the description of the video if you wanna take a look at it. So basically, they are promising that they, they will release this source code of this exploit very very soon so from what i have learned and from the information i got this exploit alone is not enough for a jailbreak to be created this would be enough to create some something like houdini you know that tool that it's not a jailbreak like it's a partial jailbreak or a jailbreak alternative it allows you to modify some stuff on your device but it's not a jailbreak so basically this exploit that will be released by Zimperium, it's not enough to get a jailbreak tool out of it. So we will have to wait and see if someone else will release any other exploit or something else that could combine maybe with this and then be able to create a fully working jailbreak for iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.2.2. So basically, if you're on iOS 11.2.5 or iOS 11.3 beta, go ahead and downgrade right now to iOS 11.2.2 or even better to iOS 11.2, which are still being signed and you will have to hurry up because Apple should stop signing them any day now because the latest release is iOS 11.2.5 and those two others or maybe or three, there are three, iOS 11.2.2.1 and 0.2.2 will be stopped being signed very very soon so you go ahead and downgrade to them if you want to have better chances of jailbreaking your device in the near future 
So that's basically it for this video guys. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos. As I told you, the jailbreak for iOS 10.3.3 and lower on all 64-bit devices should come any day now and I will be releasing a ton of videos when it does. So go ahead and subscribe to not miss any of them. And also don't forget to follow me on my social media. You will find all the links in the description of this video.